replacement can be a necessary and painful surgery with oftentimes imperfect results. Now a new inv innovation virtually eliminates any complications. Reporter Kim Horcher shows us the new technology. An estimated 200,000 people will have a hip replacement surgery this year. It's a procedure that can often be risky and painful, but not for Kathy Delavalade. I felt that my recuperation is, is amazing. I'm going to be able to go out there and run a marathon. Kathy was one of the first people in Orange County to undergo the new surgery called makoplasty. It uses a robotic arm which reduces patient pain and recovery time. After her double hip replacement, she was up and walking the very same day. Mobility is much better than what it was before the surgery, but Dr. Dore assures me that this is nothing. Dr. Lawrence Dore of the Dore Arthritis Institute in Los Angeles is one of the few pioneering surgeons in the country to use the new technique. It is very precise bone preparation followed by very precise implant positioning. We can do it with under robotic guidance that allows us to not make a human error in positioning the implant. With makoplasty, doctors can make a map of the specific areas to be removed by computer before the surgery, and the robotic arm will strictly follow it. The robotic guidance prevents doctors from ever going off course. If we go beyond our prescribed limits, what, what we are supposed to do, the robot will stop. It has a fail-safe mechanism. These changes mean a huge advancement beyond traditional hip replacement surgery, creating a better hip, ball, and cup fit, which means greater comfort and a higher success rate for patients. I'm a pretty active person. I still work. I still have my personal life. I'd like to get up and go. This is Kim Horcher reporting.